Welcome back, everyone. Today we are going to be completing some Forza Von, Forza Thon, Forza Thon. Not that hard to say. Forza Thon events. We've got four for today. Win three races in a 56 Ford F100. Perform 15 ultimate skill chains in a Ford. Complete three online races in a Ford and buy or sell any car on the auction house. Obviously, this is more of a ford Savan. <laughs> than a ford Savan. no? We're gonna build one car to complete all four of these tasks, and that is gonna be a 56 Ford F100. Speaking about old trucks, I'm in a um, Holden. This thing does burn out stock. Kind of. I mean, kind of. Where's the baby? There it is! Aha! 1956 Ford F100. Shout out to Ice Age, the best movie ever created. Uh, I think we're gonna go ahead with a, um... Ooh, I mean, you can't really you can't really go wrong with black. The interesting thing is that we have to make this truck handle, because we have to complete six races, and I don't want to do six drag races. That's boring. So, we're gonna do six normal races, and for that, we need a truck that can handle. We've got a very old, very tired engine that just... Pretty much not good for anything. We've got a 6.2 liter V8, 8.4 liter V10, and a 6.5 liter V12. None of these are Ford engines, but let's go ahead and put the Chevy engine in there. <laughs> for now, we're going to keep it naturally aspirated. We're not going to need too much power from this thing. It's just time to make it handle. So, to do that, we're going to get some, you know, lows, which, oh my god, going from freaking sport springs to ha! <laughs> oh, it's so great. Um, and then fully upgrade the rest of the platform and handling. Weight reduction getting rid of 600 pounds, bring us down to 2700. Pretty good, pretty good. And, uh... A lot better brakes. Holy cow. Now, the next thing to do is to go ahead and get some new tires on here. This is going to change the car way, way too much. Okay. Actually, that wasn't that bad. Putting us into A class. And then we're going to get 245s in the front and 245s in the rear, which isn't as good as I would like, but that's okay. I do want this thing to look like a race car. Team Dynamics Racing Pro Race 1. Wow. You know that when it has the word race in the title twice, it's, it's, it's very, very serious about racing. Now, in the front, we can get rid of that ugly, ugly bumper, and we're gonna do that. In the rear, we can get a little wing. Uh, helps a little bit, actually. Let's put that on there. And... no, definitely not. We definitely want to get a new trans in here, because that thing is old. We definitely want to get a new diff in here. And then the rest, we can do power. So, exhaust... Into cams, that really... oh, that is, that's perfect, literally. Put a cam in there, or at the top of A class. 2,705 pounds with 544 horsepower. All right, well, we're definitely gonna make it faster. Not sure if it's gonna handle that great still, but you know, maybe a little better. That's actually pretty cool right there. Oh shit, those wheels look awesome. Okay, you know what? We're changing this car a little bit. Truck, whatever, fuck off. Something like this, with these weld racing wheels. I think these things look sick, they're classic looking. They fit the truck a lot better than those other wheels. And now, we are completely done. Oh, oh yeah. Oh no, it's grippy though. It's definitely grippy. It's a lot smaller than you think it is. Oh, first gear grips up. Holy shit. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm liking this a lot. Oh, this is actually quick. Holy cow. And it can still do donuts. Well, that's good. Um, so let's go ahead and start doing these Forza Vaughn events. I think this thing looks absolutely badass. Oh, all right. Battle of the trucks, I guess. We've got a, a race truck, a Raptor, and a circuit truck. Oh. Come on, little race truck. You got it. Just don't get beat. Oh my god, that Ford Raptor's gonna be so much faster. But it's okay, I can... Oh, oh, or maybe not. Maybe not. It probably has more power, but this thing is light. Oh yeah, this is good already. All right. Brakes. How does this car, truck, truck, how does this truck feel? Oh, it feels good. Uh, uh, yeah, feels real good. That's, um, that's kind of what she said. Now this thing is planted. It handles really good. A little bit of oversteer, but I can pretty much go full throttle through these corners. Okay, maybe, maybe not, maybe not. And look at those guys. They're in the dust already. This thing feels like it's way too skinny and way too long. It's all right. It's, it's doing so well. Oh yeah, I feel like this thing is very quick for A-Class especially. A little bit of understeer there, that's all right. Raptor's kind of keeping up, but eh, at the same time, not at all. That's lap number one. Let's keep it up. I don't like this interior though, not at all. Gotta get them apexes. And full throttle. Full throttle and just a little bit of oversteer, it's great. 
That was full throttle. It's just the fact that you can just grip up. It only has 245s, but the power band is so even and it's just so good. Oh, they're not even behind. Where are they? They're gone. Oh, a little bit of overseer. Okay, quite a lot of overseer there. Okay, all right. I didn't even tune it. I also don't really know how to do circuit tunes that great, so. And you know, according to a lot of you guys, I don't know how to do any tunes that great, so thank you. Oh, wait a second. Forzathon precise performance. Oh my gosh, we already completed one of the Forzathon events, so um, now we just have to win three online races, and we're about to win one. There's the finish line, and three, two, one. Boom. Okay, so we, oh fuck, we've got a cyclone. All right, GG. It's over. Um, that truck is gonna be victorious in this little battle. All right, let's 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 see what happens here. I can launch this thing pretty hard. Oh yeah. Cyclone, what you doing there, bud? The Audi's in first, actually. Did not expect this. Oh fuck. Well, that explains a lot. There he goes. And now the Audi's pulling too? What? Am I really gonna get last here? Note to self, the circuit truck is not a drag car. All right, oh, what the f Why do you bring your warthog? Okay, you know what? <laughs> okay, well, interesting choice of cars, but let's see how we do. Let's see if my subscribers can whoop my ass or not. I have a feeling I'm not gonna get first. Oh, a little Myers Manx. Kinda slow, sorry, bud, but. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Okay, actually, that surprised me. I thought I was just gonna go straight into the wall there, but the brakes, the brakes are good on this car. This thing is so much better than I thought it was gonna be. First place, can we keep it? Doesn't really look like anyone has circuit built cars specifically. Oh, that Myers Manx is, oh, first gear, rip. I think it's one of the only circuit cars I've built that I actually am ever in first gear. Well, I answered my question. Am I faster than my subscribers? The answer is yes, for these four at least. I can't even see them back there. That's, that's kind of sad actually. Man, too easy boys, too easy. Finished, first place. That means we've got one more race to win. I should, g oh, there it is, there it is, okay. So we just got a Ford Mustang Boss 302 Horizon Edition, boys. All right, they get one more chance to beat me. Um, how's this gonna go? Oh, and we've started in like last place. All right, that's interesting. There goes the Cyclone, just spinning its wheels, and let's do this, we've got two people to pass. This will actually be a little more fun, hopefully. Although they're making it easy already. Oh, little mini, you're quite small, and you're quite slow. Oh, roasted. And you don't know how to break. <laughs> Straight into the wall goes the mini. I was understeering around that corner. Now we just have the Audi to whoop. And I think this will be pretty easy. Man, I think it's drifting like mad. Pretty sure it's all-wheel drive, too. We know it's fast and straight from that drag race. Who's the better driver? Oh, I'm, I, I am on his ass. Oh, on the inside line. Floor it. Come on, power! Yes! He's got a little bit too much wheel spin. I don't know, I don't know what kind of tires he has, but they don't look too great. I cut the corner, I'm sorry. First place, for a little bit at least. All right, we're doing good, we're doing good. Can we hold it like this, though? Like we give him let Full throttle around that corner. No understeer, no oversteer. The balance in this car is just so perfect without doing anything. Besides the upgrading it, of course. Full throttle, a little bit of... That guy's just spinning too much. Doesn't have enough traction. Whereas me, I just go full throttle out of these corners and it's good, all is good. And that is lap two. We got one more lap. Audi's falling farther and farther behind. I think we've got this in the bag. Fourth gear, a little bit sideways, not too bad though. Around the last corner, there's the finish line. And with it, the last Forzathon Punto. And there it is. Huge shout out to the four subscribers who played with me today. Thank you, uh, you're the only people who would play with me, which is surprising considering I've got like 170,000 freaking subscribers. Why does no one want to play with me ever? It's so sad. However, there's still one thing left to do, and that is to sell my F100 race truck. <laughs> So guys, that is going to be it for today. Hopefully you did enjoy. If you did, make sure to hit the like button. If you're new, make sure to subscribe. 
Follow me on Twitter. You know, I've got a Twitter and I post there a lot, but I only have like 2,000 followers because I never talk about it. So go follow me on Twitter. Uh, and that's pretty much it. So goodbye and fuck. <laughs>